today's the day. This afternoon we're gonna be heading up to London. I'm gonna be undergoing surgery and we're gonna film the whole thing. Now, 15 months ago, I had a major operation to repair a ruptured Achilles tendon. And quite frankly, it was brutal. At the time, I really hoped that would be the last time I'd ever have to go under the knife, but unfortunately, as fate would have it, I recently suffered an avulsion fracture. And despite all my attempts to rest it, rehab it, and give it as much opportunity as possible to heal, it's not healing. So as much as it pains me to say it, today we're gonna to be heading up to the Harley Street Specialist Hospital, and I'm gonna be undergoing surgery on my little finger. What, well, say that bit again. Um, you're having surgery or what? Mm -hmm. I'm be having surgery on <clears throat> my little finger. What? Did you say? I'm gonna have surgery it? on my little finger. Your finger? Little finger. Your little finger? Yeah. I've traveled four hours up here. I thought you said it was life changing. Well, no, I, I definitely told Literally you it was my little, little finger. finger. Yeah, I told, I, I'm sure I said that to you. Let's get a wobble ball. So I can drink it now and it's gonna be fine? Yeah. Okay, let's have a look. Oh no. You said it'll be fine. <laughs> Okay, so all joking aside, I actually am having surgery on my finger today. Look at my finger, mate. Is that a normal finger? Mara, is that a normal finger? Yeah. No, it's not. It definitely is by no means a normal finger. So basically, a few months back, whilst filming Gladiators, I sustained an avulsion fracture. So basically, a bit of bone here has broken away, and it got pushed back with such force, it's actually rotated a hunt. Mara, mate, what can... <laughs> rotated 180 no, degrees so it's just not going back where it should be volar plate which is kind of like a soft tissue structure is also ruptured and so my finger is just getting more and more like not straight we were hoping like me and the surgeon that it would be okay because it initially it was doing all right the movement was good the joint wasn't really compromised didn't hurt too much i could still use it <laughs> but it's just getting progressively worse like it still hurts all the time if i catch it so basically operation is happening the plan is they're going to try and fix it we're going to film the whole thing it should be i mean it's my second I, i've not had any surgery in my entire life now i've had two in the space of like a year hopefully it goes all right hopefully i don't die afterwards. yeah after the achilles but i put in some clips after the achilles one i was literally off my head subscribe because yeah on the spectrum of good things to do subscribe to my channel was like on the upper end of the <laughs> so hopefully that won't happen again <laughs> but anyway we're going up in a bit i need to get as much food in beforehand as i possibly can so we're gonna go and have some breakfast is that and... so you can throw up again afterwards <laughs> Can I, can I do like a bit of a customised thing, please? I've got, sur I've got surgery today to start my last meal. I might die, so. <laughs> well, I might, I feel it could happen. Um, it's like the base item. Can I get like two bagels? Can I get sausage, bacon, scrambled egg, halloumi, and avocado, please? Right, high five. High five. Oh wait, I've got four and a half. <laughs> Intensive. Ah, mate, it's incredible. Sausages, halloumi, get that out of the way, mate. Sausages, halloumi, avocado, egg, bacon, bagels. Basically, yeah, with as many yeah. calories and as much protein as possible. Because the op is in a bit, and they've told me to have a big window where I don't eat food, basically. So after this, I can't eat any more food. What? What? So it's right here, it stays in place. Whoa, mate, whoa. I think you're two minutes, you're two minutes over. <laughs> no, it's okay. Zero appetite, I'm trying to like force this down. I really don't want to eat it, but I need the calories. Right? What are you doing? I'm so funny. I had to eat that at like 9am. I would, normally I wouldn't eat a meal until like lunchtime. And we have to go and train. <laughs> I have to go and train legs in a minute. Basically, as well as that being my last workout, so this is going to be my last workout, obviously. I'll be able to train after the op, but like, I'm gonna be limited. I won't be able to put anything on my fingers for a while, like a good few weeks, maybe even a month. So I'm gonna try and get in like a solid leg workout now while I can. That meal is the worst preparation ever. What is the best preparation ever, however, is consuming the nicest tasting energy drink on the planet. Which, by the way, at the time of watching this video, will finally be back in stock on Amazon. So I'll put a link to Amazon at the top of the description. Go and pick it up. 
go and pick up some more through energy, you get free next day delivery in the UK. Cheapest slash most efficient way of getting it. So go and get some from Amazon. Make sure you leave us a five star review. Anyone that buys Morsi Energy and gives us a five star review, Fab said he'd give them, he transferred them 500 pounds via PayPal. So DM Fab, he'll sort that out for you. Uh, let's go to the gym. Okay, so kitchen wise, we have got to the Session is done. It was a good one. Remarkably managed to not be sick. Got a good amount of volume in pre-surgery. Happy with that. Knee sleeves and the lever belt were both from Morsia. Link in description to that as well. Workout was from the Morsia out. We've got quicker, like 30 and 45 minute workouts to come into the app very soon. So keep your eye out for that. And lastly, right behind you, as we speak right now, the house is on absolute mad one. Next house video coming in one or two weeks time. It's gonna be sick. But we have a train to catch London. We are cutting it quite fine. Should probably go. Matt decided to get coffee. About two minutes ago, the train is literally going to be pulling up now, mate. So I hope you enjoy that. And the doctor said no, no coffee, yeah, it's milk. milk. If I throw up for that, then I deserve that. I deserve to be have my vomit cascade down myself. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to Toilet Reviews with Matt Does Fitness. Yes, mate. Mate, stop wasting your time. <laughs> <laughs> That was weird. Right, we're in London. Uh, we need to head over to the hospital. It's Harley Street Specialist Hospital. Before we do that though, it's only right I give this guy the big send off he deserves. Let's go and show him some of the sights. Okay, that was emotional. We now need to stop procrastinating so I'm not late and get to the actual hospital. I'm actually starting to get nervous, you know. I'm lost. Ah, oh, it's literally right there. Oh. <laughs> uh, I've got a sur I've got surgery at four. Last time you had something to eat or drink in the last 12 hours? Uh, eat, I had breakfast at like 9 o'clock. This morning, yeah? Yeah. Anything after? Uh, no, not food wise, no. I've had, I had a coffee like a bit after that, but since then just water. Who's taking you home today? Uh, this guy. Cool. I'm gonna bring a different cuff because you have, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm gonna take your blood pressure and get you changed. Okay. Okay, okay cool. They asked me to leave the room while I did this and he insisted on staying. Pump cover. <laughs> that actually does look, if it was cut off there, it would be like it. Yeah. I'll grab my phone. Thank you. Thank you. Very good. good. Ready for action? Yes, mate, I'm ready. Yes, ready? I'm ready. I know, I know, it changed. Oh, no, this, is this is fab. Hi, how are you doing? Fabian, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. you. So, all right. Ready? Yes, mate. Yeah. Fully naked on this, is that right? Yeah. I'm not ready. <laughs> <laughs> so, plan is, we've got Dr. Pepper, who's a brilliant anesthetist. Mm -hmm. He's going to have a top of the arm. The arm will be numb, it'll stay numb for 24 hours. 24 hours? 16 to 24 hours. <laughs> will I move it or not? You, you, can, you can do, but it'll be like a dead arm. Or it'll, it'll give you good pain relief overnight, which is, yeah. which is great. Okay, which will keep, good, you, yeah, keep yeah. you nice and comfortable. Okay. So what okay. we're going to do is, we're going to do an such an incision 
that will enable you to get going earlier. Yeah. Now the fragment of bone that we've, that, that's been injured is kind of on this side. Yeah. Okay. So we're going to have a look in the finger. Attach on that is the volar plate, maybe the collateral ligaments as well. Yeah. That fragment of bone, we're going to reattach a small screw yeah. or a suture anchor, depending on the size of it and, and, and the integrity of it. Yeah. Fix that back in place, close everything up, and then hopefully be strong enough to get you going. Back in the gym tomorrow. Back in the gym tomorrow. Big dumbbell rows tomorrow. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Bicep curls, dumbbell. And then, and then healing time. A couple yeah. of weeks of wounds to heal. And then four weeks, we should hopefully be free enough to actually get you gripping and getting going. Now, small background risks, things like infection. Very small, we'll give you a dose of antibiotics. Scar, a little bit of stiffness, we'll overcome that hopefully. The main things really are the fixation. Uh, we're not doing a general anesthesia. Because you're having a tourniquet on your hand, yeah, that's going to be an hour long. It's kind of unpleasant, the tourniquet. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's genuinely unpleasant. So we'd have to block you up high, put a low fat stick up higher mm -hmm. to make this numb as well. So you're gonna need essentially the ultrasound machine, the arm on this, <coughs> put the ultrasound here, yeah. needle in here, yeah. under low fat stick. Success? Well, it'll work. I mean, it's just a matter of getting it right. There is a risk of nerve damage with this, okay? How are you feeling after all that? I'm not more concerned about it than the job I mean. Slam a needle through my like, bicep to get to the nerve. Oh, oh yeah, so you didn't hear that. Fab's allowed to come in as if they're going to let Fab come in. I didn't sign in. up for that. I was going to come in. Also, so just to give you, if you were unaware, they, so they're going to literally, an incision here and here, they're pulling that whole bit back. So you'll literally be, I better see into my finger like the actual bone. That's mad, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Nah, man, this is... Literally made it all worth it. I would do this all over again now just to see. What is this? Okay, so, look at the theatre. You pop up there, hit on the pillow, and please yeah. don't be alarmed. So we can keep an eye on the back of your gun. Yeah. I'm going to get a little bit of something just to make it feel a bit lightheaded, okay? You may not notice it, but it may make it a bit relaxed. It does start having an effect now. Yeah, you, you can feel it. Like on a mad one. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so in fact, that nerve there, those two nerves there, that nerve there. I feel like I've done like 17 scoops of pre-workout. <laughs> yeah, like. okay, and there's a vein directly above the artery, which is a bit of a nuisance. Grab it. Nasty scratch, sir. So nasty scratch, nasty doctor. And the needle, you see the needle going into the, you look at the screen, you see the needle going into the screen. Tricky one for you. Yeah, it. and it's just going. It's the like, uh, straight, straight, no. uh, you know, yeah. fairly electric shock sensations. Yeah, like yeah. low key tingling. Uh, trying to get down. That's yeah, must retain his nerve going. Lift your arm in the air. Pull away from me. Pull away from me. It's hard to hand. Okay, that's not normal, is it? <laughs> no, I can't. Yeah, okay, not push good. me away. Yes, yeah, so what we're going to do here, as you said, let's, let's I can bring this down a little bit. Is that why it's so big? Yeah, exactly. It's all quite thick end. It's mad getting live commentary on my <laughs> own finger surgery. Very thick and through here. This is oh, normal. It's a pulley insane. system. Keeps the tendon flush against the bone. Yeah. Then the injured fragment, we're going to look for it in here. So that's why my finger's gone mad trying to heal it. Trying to heal it, yeah, you can see how it's just really yeah. fixed. And that then is then literally insane. I'm going to do a giveaway in the comment <laughs> to win that bit of skin. <laughs> comment, I want that bit of skin, and that will pick someone. What would happen if there was like a fire alarm now? You stay here, everyone else goes. Yeah. You just pick up, you just carry on. We've got this little fragment just sitting underneath here. We're going to try and loosen that up a little bit. It's getting loose. Are you hungry? Oh. <laughs> you starving? Yeah, actually, yeah. Um, Give me some food. Me too. Yeah, big man. Uh -huh. Give me nine chicken nuggets, please. I've got the maddest pins and needles in my arm. Oh, really? Yeah. From the tourniquet thing? It's starting to hurt now. Uh, it's quite a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Feels like there's like a yeah, yeah. anaconda wrapped around my arm. I mean, it's just uh, like proper, yeah. like, throbbing. Are you going to go to sleep? I think so. Um, I'll wake up with that. Yeah, you'll wake up straight away afterwards, yeah. I'll just give you a little bit of this stuff and you just drift off essentially. And then you can get me up straight away. Yeah, yeah, straight away. I'm going to try and stay awake. Yeah, I'm going to try and beat yeah. sedation. Okay. Wow, it's happening. I'm going to beat sedation. So I'm going to beat sedation. <laughs> Is that for the, is that for the? <laughs> My dust fitness versus sedation. Has everyone ever overridden sedation? Uh, 
No, no, in the end. Um, Reward record for resisting, so that you should. <laughs> no, I'm gonna set it right now. Sedation can't beat me. 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 This is the anchor that we're doing. It's a little two millimeter anchor with some suture that comes off it, and we're going to reattach the, the pulled off fragment or the tissue with the fragment uh, onto the bone. Anchors in. Anchors in. Check the x rays, we're very happy. We're going to then try and reattach that pulled off tissue down. Good, so, new finger, hopefully. All done. All done. So we've got nice, nice and straight. Just a little bit of time there, but with some physio, it should, should come along really nicely. Waking him up now. Yeah, there's one case of the unpleasant bit. Two minutes, should wake up in about two minutes' time. Okay, it's all over, sir. Pull it. Pull it all in. Good morning. Good morning. Done, mate. It's done. Uh, head first, look, yeah. Just waking up now. All done, alright? You alright? It's crazy, I feel like wide awake. We're going to sedation, so awake. You did have the sedation, yeah. So great. Yeah, I've got you doing things. I'll bring them up. I'll come back in. Okay. <laughs> I finished the surgery off for you, mate. I did the last part for you. Crab looks like a crab. I'm <laughs> awake. You're awake? Oh, my God. The bad thing, I was pretending to be asleep. <laughs> you were pretending to be asleep. I need you to drink as much water as you can. Yeah, let's go. Because... Gallon of water? Give me that one of those big bites. Open your eyes for me. Man. <laughs> You gotta leave that on. No, no, leave that on, please. Well, mate. Because you have a heavy arm now, so you won't that feel was much. intense. The sick, the sedation bit was sedic. Was sedic? Just in loads of sedic. <laughs> <laughs> That's a more? Sidic. The body you want to take. Can I take this mask off? Yeah, yeah, you yeah. can. Take your trousers off, Al. Take my trousers off? <laughs> okay. <laughs> what will happen now? Whoa. So what will happen now is, if you're ready to eat something, I'm gonna bring you something right to up. eat. Well drowsy. So as soon as you That's can, pass urine. Yeah. Okay. Drink water and have something to eat. Thinking like 20 chicken nuggets and then a Big Mac with no cheese and ketchup. Very good. Then quarter final. Quarter final. <laughs> quarter final. Arsenal, I want to see the Champions League draw. Well. Think for the next few like months, I'll just use one eye. Do you want to again? Diana. Diana, you are the best. You're simply the Me. best. I, I've got video of you flat so out snoring now. No, I haven't. I didn't no, snore. You were flat out snoring. I've just added a snoring sound. No, I have that. not. You were chatting absolute shit when you, you were going You were going to chat. You were, you were chatting. I've been fishing since I was like four years old. Right. And I've started fishing like three days a week for the last. Serious? Month. I actually caught like a seven foot. Yeah, I'm good, mate. I'm like super alert. You're just like <laughs> Yeah. Black cherry yogurt and a fruit yeah. salad. Would you yeah, understand yeah, with? No, no, I don't think it's a good idea. It's honestly it's the best idea. It's so much more efficient. <laughs> Put this on Instagram. Yeah. Am I gonna YouTube. find you there? Am YouTube. I gonna am I gonna find myself there? Fine, it'll get like 70 views, it's fine, don't worry. You've only got 10 subscribers. Yeah. I know you have a million, over a million. Oh. You have over oh, a million. You, you do. You <laughs> do. I'm gonna say that I'll be sick, mate. Do a collab. Oh, yeah. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> You're a weirdo. I feel like drunk and like I've just had like a 30 hour sleep, do you know what I mean? Yeah. It was mad, it was just like gone. You told me just now you were pretending to be asleep. <laughs> no, actually, no I didn't. Yeah. You said it's mad because I was awake the whole time, I was just pretending. <laughs> Even when I'm unconscious I still have sick banter. Mate, the thing, the like turn of coat thing was like Tonicate. brutal. Yeah. Felt like Brian George just punching my arm constantly, like it was yeah. like, throbbing. It's seen pain. Do you know? Do you know how long? Do you know how long I've been here? 
Look, oh, look everyone. Minutes. It's 20 minutes. 7 32. So, in order to get out, I need to be able to eat, drink, and then go to the toilet. So I'm eating, I'm drunk, now I'm going to go to the toilet. <gasps> oh, that was weird, mate. Dad, can you come to the toilet with me, please? Yeah. I'm going to bath as well. They're bathing. Done a wee? Did more than a wee. <laughs> Did everything. <laughs> First, like, gave me the like sedation thing. That was like mad as well. Why? I felt like absolutely out of it. Like, really? Oh, the feeling of like first... being like, like, woo, like that. Yeah. Feeling. I know you got a bit. You got a bit. Um... You look sleepy. <laughs> <laughs> I still feel like seventy percent drunk. Oh good. man, it went really well. So that fragment was yeah. too small to take a screw. So what we did, we removed it and reattached all the soft tissue using a soft tissue anchor. Appreciate it, dude. That's so awesome. good. Nice. Took a little bit longer, but yeah, uh, yeah. We, we took our time. We wanted yeah. to do it properly. That I'm pretty sure awesome. I could now perform that operation on the other finger. Listen, uh, I, do need, I do need a partner. Okay, yeah, <laughs> yeah if you're up for it. Next week, yeah, I'll be in. <laughs> oh, that was, that was a joke. I'm fine. Oh, I'm done. I feel good, probably because I'm still riding high after the sedation. But basically, what I read between the lines there is that I've now got the strongest little finger on the planet and the world record for resisting sedation for the longest. So all in all, a great day. Okay, we're done. That is the video over. Next one, we'll see what the fallout is like. Hopefully, I can get back to light training soon because I want to train. But that is that. I hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed it, drop it a thumbs up. If you are new to the channel, please subscribe. Guys, can I interest you in some high-grade narcotics? Oh, no, thank you. <laughs> thank you. A bit rude.